Hallelujah. We are going, God's beautiful people. We are going out there you know, around the world. Uh, what's going on there you now around the world? As you see, Sister Cell, and I'm back. I am back to pray for those of you that are suffering with cancer. Okay? Yes, I am here to pray for those of you that are suffering with cancer. But before I do so, I just want to thank you guys. I just want to thank you guys for viewing my videos. And thank you guys for sub subscribing to my channel and to like and comment. Thank you very much. Because I just want to say putting out my videos out there. There is not one video that I have that I don't get a view or I put out that I don't get a, a view on it. And you know what guys? If I get one view, I am satisfied because at least one person get the message. Amen. Hallelujah. So as I said, I was going to pray for you guys out there that are suffering with with cancer. Guys, please, if you know anyone in the hospital or anyone at home suffering with this sickness, please send them the video. Share the video, please. If they're in the hospital, please let them get this video because there is no doubt in my mind that someone is going to get healed from this video okay hallelujah thank you jesus and i we are thanking god in advance for that healing or for that person that will be getting at their healing okay hallelujah glory to god but guys you know that sister cell you know i love the word and guess what guys I cannot pray for you without the word because the word is Jesus Christ of Nazareth amen and he is also the healer so I cannot come to you without him and I have to come to you with through him, him in the, the is which is the word. Okay, all right, thank God. And I'm going to read from Psalms, Psalm 6, from verse 2. Have mercy upon me, O Lord, for I am weak, O Lord, heal me, for my bones are vexed. My soul is also so vexed, but thou, O Lord, how long? Return, O Lord, deliver my soul, O save me from for thy mercy's sake. For in death there is no remembrance of thee in the grave. Who shall give thee thanks? That's a question. David asks in the Lord in his prayer. God, if if me did, we can't give you praise in a, we can't remember you in the grave. And he said to him, God, when a person did, or when a man or a woman did, he over then can praise you. Over. And you don't want the dead to praise you, you want the living to praise you. So, that, so he was saying to the Lord, you want me to praise you? You want me to remember you? Heal me. 
for I am weak. How much of how much of you out there watching me on this video are weak for what you are going through? Weak. Sometimes you feel like giving up. You cannot take it. Like what the psalmist is say, have mercy upon me, O oh Lord. Man is crying out and say, heal me. I am in pain, Papa Jesus. This sickness that the Lord bid me to pray for. This dangerous and cruel sickness, cancer, is a wicked sickness, a dangerous and deadly disease. It is life threatening. When cancer take you, it take miracle for you to come around. And you know, say miracle can only be wrought by Jesus Christ. So, we are going to pray this afternoon with the expectation of a miracle. A miracle for you, sir. A miracle for you, mom. Baby boy, baby girl, youth that are suffering with this disease, we are believing God for a miracle for you this afternoon. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, your son, I ask you at this present moment to consecrate me. I'm asking at this precious moment to wash me in your precious blood. Make me whole, make me clean, Lord, make me pure. Jesus, make me something that you can use, O oh God. As I pray, Almighty God, for your people this afternoon. For I pray for that man and pray for that woman, that boy, that girl, that are battering with this disease, cancer. Jesus, cancer. That deadly disease, God, that come to kill Mighty God, I come against you, cancer. I come against you, cancer, breast cancer. I come against you. Cancer of the womb, I come against you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Cancer of the brain, I come against you. Colon cancer, I come against you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Whatever cancer you may be. Whatever name, type of cancer you may be this afternoon, I come, I come against you. I call you out from the root. Be destroyed in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I declare upon the word of God that by the stripe of Jesus Christ, that individual, that man, that woman is being healed. That boy, that girl is being healed in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command you to leave that body, blood, Cancer, cancer that are in the blood. I command you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, cancer in the eye. I command you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, prostrate cancer. I command you to come out of that man now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Get out of that body. Get out, get out, get out from the root in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. For by the stripe of the Son of God, that man, that woman, that boy, that girl is being healed. The word of God declared that they wish above all things that we be prosperous and be in good health. I declare good health in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I pull you out of that womb. I pull you out of that breast in the name of Jesus Christ. You prostrate cancer, I pull you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You colon cancer, don't dare. Hallelujah. In the womb, I 
pull you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Cancer in the Lord and small intestine, I pull you out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ this afternoon. I pull you out and I declare the word of God by his stripes. We are healed by the stripes. They are healed by the stripes. They are healed by the stripes of Jesus Christ. They are healed. He sent his word, which is Jesus Christ, to heal all our diseases, to heal all our infirmities. In the name of Jesus Christ, to, at this present moment, in the name of Jesus, lift your feet. Hallelujah. You are out there lift your feet around the world listening and watching this video lift your feet lift your feet in the name of Jesus it is impossible to please God without the feet we walk by faith and not by sight tell yourself that you are healed speak to that cancer speak to that cancer say cancer get out of my body come out of my body my body is a temple of the living god my body is not a room or a bed for cancer for you cancer leave and go now in jesus name you have authority ma'am you have authority, sir, over your body in Jesus' name. There is a bomb in Gilead. Jesus Christ is our bomb in Gilead. The great physician is sympathizing Jesus. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. We just celebrate, hallelujah, his death and resurrection. And I call you to arise just as how Jesus burst that tomb. Hallelujah. And he arose. Hallelujah. Triumphantly. You shall get out of that cancer. That cancer shall come out of you. And you shall escape that cancer. You shall overcome that cancer. Jesus Christ of Nazareth overcome the grave. You shall overcome that cancer in his name. In his name. We are more than conqueror. We are more than conqueror. And the word of God declare no weapon that farm against us shall prosper. No weapon that farm against you, ma'am. No weapon that farm against us. No weapon that farm against you, my son, my daughter out there shall prosper. We are an overcomer. And greater is he that is in us than cancer. Greater is he that is in you than cancer. Greater is he that is in you, ma'am. Greater is he that is in you, sir, than cancer. Cancer will have to bow to Jesus Christ. Cancer will have to bow to that name. Every knee shall bow and every tongue must confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Lift your feet and look to Jesus Christ, the author and the finisher of your feet. He promised us in his word that he will heal us. He promised us in his word. And I want to give you a few scriptures. That you can read Isaiah 38 verse 16 and 17. Isaiah 41 verse 10. First, first John 1 and 2. I wish above all things <laughs> that you be been prosperous and be in good health. As your soul prosper. And you have John 14 13. Whatsoever you ask in my name that will I do so that my father will be glorified jesus said whatever you ask in his name that he will do that his father will be glorified 
God bless you. And God keep you. And please. Comment. And share. And like the video man. Comment let us talk. And if you are getting any. Help. From none of my video. Don't be afraid. To let me know if you need. If you are sick. And you need me to pray for you. Send in a prayer request, okay? Send in a prayer request. Let us pray together. Let us believe together. Anything two of us come in agreement on, the Bible said, it shall be done. It shall be done, okay? It shall be done. God, wonderful people. God bless you. See you in the next video. Bye.